He can, yeah, I think, I think I heard Fox. But he's better at sort of making it seem like, oh, you know, you'll be able to throw out a safe aerial or something here. You'll be able to dash that near boost grab me, and then he's just out of reach because his yep. ground game is that much better than, no. the, uh, than the other Foxes. No, Leffen's punish game in this matchup has always been super impressive to me. I mean, you saw that even with the sort of tense games against Android, uh, mm -hmm. as far as game one and two is concerned, at least. Uh, but Android did uh, find some openings, which is typically very hard to do against Leffen. So uh, I guess we will see if uh, if Leffen is just having a off uh, anti chic day or if it's just Android who right. uh, has just really figured out the matchup, which uh, his victory over Prof seems yeah. to indicate. Yeah, yeah, no, Android playing really well. One thing that I uh, that really impresses me about over Triforce, even relative to the other European Sheiks, though, is his punish game. Yeah, and where um, yeah, where the other Sheiks kind of seem to. Well, they, he just doesn't seem to drop the tech chases. I don't know if that's going to change against Leffen, but yeah, even with the PAL tech chase, which is you know noticeably harder. Yeah. No, he's uh, he definitely got a lot out of it against Prof, mm -hmm. and um, you saw him set up a really cute um, um, trap against Leffen uh, on the last stock with this up throw underneath the platform. Because the only way that the up throw will lead to a forward tilt is if the the fox di's away from the sheik. Right. And so when he threw him up under the platform, he would either get the forward tilt if he di'd away from the platform. Or he has off, to land on the or, platform. Yeah, exactly. And he gets the tech chase. Right, right, So right. either way, over is in a really good position. Mm -hmm. But yeah, Leffen just <laughs> basically outside of a sort of shaky start has been playing it start really, really well. Yeah. Over, did not get his jump back and he charges the up smash and gets a KO. Yeah, like uh, with other other foxes, I I'm never shocked to see them flub an anti sheet edge guard, but I don't know if I can recall Leffen ever doing it. He yeah. just seems like so ready to capitalize on any any opening, mm -hmm. no matter how small. Mm -hmm. Always ready to go, always ready to execute. Just the you know natural born killer, so to speak. Yep. I tried to get. Get to the right side of Overtry first to get the back air to send him back out. But yeah. Get the reverse, that's fine. It. Up the yeah. upper, not gonna connect because of Smash the Eye. Yep. Oh! Oh Good my god! Good take there by Leffen. Mm, down smashing on shield. Mm -hmm. Leffen uh, sort of lets. Oh, and that's gonna be his stock. Yeah. Leffen sort of lets him get away with it because uh, Foxes can punish that yeah. if uh, Sheiks are uh, getting a bit too uh, lazy with their. Placement of the down smashes. Yep. Mm -hmm. Shine up smash, gonna be enough two stock victory here for uh, Leffen. Yep. And uh, it takes a breath of relief there. That seems like, seems like uh, Leffen also maybe not completely satisfied with that match against someone because it did seem like he had some, some mistakes, even though, you know, obviously he won very commandingly. Yeah. You know, Leffen, one of these guys that's never, never satisfied with any less, less than perfection, so. Yeah. Yeah, it's a bit of a, a trope to say, like, uh, oh, anything under a four stock is a failure, but I feel like for Leffen, it really does apply. He seems, like, legitimately disappointed with even really, really impressive victories. Right, right. Seems like he, he doesn't really care about anyone else's uh, opinion other than his own right. when it comes to his own play. But then again, he's also uh, um, a harsh critic of himself when he doesn't perform, so. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Kind of live and die by the sword. Yep. Push off back air there. Leffen implementing some um, um, techniques that Armada brought to light again this week. Right. Didn't really invent it, but put, uh, put the spotlight on it. There's Ooh. the, uh, yeah, the up throw, up throw combo tree. Oh! Ooh. Over should be able to get this pretty easily, yeah. Yep. Interesting to note that uh, Over gave uh, Leffen uh, port 4 here, which is uh, an advantage in the Sheik versus Fox matchup. How's that? Uh, at 0%, if uh, um, Fox is at the higher number port, mm. uh, meaning, you know, the furthest to the right, right. Uh, he can get guaranteed um, up tilt from ah. up throw. Ah. Whereas uh, if uh, he has the lower uh, port, Sheik will be able to jump out. Right. Because the, the the throw has more lag frames depending on your port. One more frame of, uh, of hit stun, right? Yeah. Oh, over. Kind of coming alive a little bit. Yeah. A nice uh, needle turnaround back air there to keep Leffen out. Mm -hmm. 
And Ofer's got a, a great sense of kind of when to go off stage uh, to, to edge guard against Fox too. <laughs> Connects with wow. the Shine Bear, summoning his inner Falco Lombardi there. Oh, yep. what oh, was that Shine? <laughs> Ofer actually recovering from yeah. it, which probably would not have expected. Uh, he, I think he flubbed a wave dash there, unfortunately. Yeah. No, I thought he was super dead there, but Leffen opted to roll, and again, the roll is countered by the high up B above the ledge. Yep. And over here. Playing well, but uh, yeah, just oh wow, oh, oh the needle, the needle and the jab. Yeah, Leffen gets his jump back, but it's not gonna matter. Jab down smash, setting Leffen far enough away. This is very much doable for over Triforce now. Yeah, gets the grab. Let's see what he's got. Let's see, there's the there's the the proper reaction tech chase that we didn't quite see from Android. Oh, and he tried to down smash a Leffen, smash us out of the drill, even game. Leffen trading back air with forward air. Yeah. He nears in the corner and Overtriper's just kind of not ready to, to get the proper shield grab. Looked like Leffen was looking for a turnaround up tilt there and he probably would have connected but couldn't get the turnaround. Oh. And this could be... Oh, Ooh. he connects with the needle. Yeah, last wow. minute. That's going to be <laughs> Over. it. Over. Getting one on the board there. and um, I had no idea how he was going to end that, that edge guard <laughs> sequence. It looked like he kind of messed up but... He, he kind of edge canceled and, and, and got a back around. That was yeah. very impressive. Yeah, Over has some uh, unconventional uh, techniques in his yeah, look arsenal. At his eyes. So, yeah, looks very <laughs> focused. <laughs> so wide open. All right, Pokemon Stadium, extremely good stage in this matchup. This is the only stage I beat uh, when we played a tournament earlier. The only stage I beat him on. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, he was actually able to take a game off of Prof here in their uh, winner set. Oh, wow. Pokemon. Yeah, no, over, uh, he's at a, so he's basically just a Fox bracket then. <laughs> yes. I don't think he's played any other character in the winner's bracket. Jabs. Ooh, big opportunity here. Tech chasing. And the, okay. Yeah, Seemed strong. like he might have threatened a needle turn on back air. Didn't really throw anything out. Up air. Extending it. Beautiful stuff here by Over. Ooh, and he gets ah. off the ledge at the last minute. It doesn't matter. Leffen messes off his uh, up his uh, ledge dash. Right. Oh wow. Over is coming alive, man. Yeah. It's tech chase. Ooh, and the wow. needles are gonna send him out. Good tech there by Leffen though, and catches Over on the way in. Yeah. Good. So uh, get the needle here. Yeah. Ooh, scary stuff. Oh, yeah. and he gets a grab there. Off the spot dodge. Who needs uh, spot dodge shine when you can uh, spot dodge grab, right? Yeah. Jeez, and yeah, Le Leffen for, <laughs> for kind of the first time all day looking a little lost. That was a, just gives him the, the hit on the Shino stall. Leffen's going to fight fight this. Oh, that can happen very easily. Yeah, ooh, avoids the back air. Very well done by uh, over Triforce there. Again, going high, oh taking God. those frames. Yeah, Leffen just kind of giving this to him. Yeah. That, that'll do it. Mm, and uh, Pokemon, a little bit Battlefield-esque on the ledges. You can't really ride the wall that well. Yeah, no, no, no. So it's just a, just the, you know, the yeah, little lip. Tiny little lip there is that you can ride, but otherwise you have to go straight up, and it makes Cheek's life so much easier when edge guarding Fox. Mm -hmm. And uh, four stocks to one here. Who would have thought that? Yeah, Leffen, I mean, I, I, I'm always an advocate of Fox going in on the transformations. I think, you know, if you can get in, you can set up infinites, you can set up a lot of really good offense, but and I, I respect Leffen for going for it, but yeah, he just kind of made a lot of flubs when he was down there. Back yeah. yeah. He's gonna need a huge comeback now. Yeah, and um, yeah, Leffen was uh, looking for a lot of those aggressive shine spikes against Android as well. Mm -hmm. Android countered it with uh, up air as the set went on, but over opting to just uh, DI out and get around it that way. Down smash though, sending him the wrong way. Wow, and yeah, this over. It. Oh yeah, my god. That's it. Three stock victory for over here, and he takes a lead here in the set two to one. And, <laughs> he's, uh, he's feeling it, dude. Yeah, he is feeling he's it. He's like growling. Looking like a caged animal right now. Mm -hmm. Looking poised to take out the number two player in Sweden. Yeah, he's going viral. <laughs> going viral. Yeah, I see what you did there. Yeah. Hashtag. I mean, I really, viral. I just read his shirt. Yeah. All right, FD, trying, trying the other of the extremely good Fox counter picks against you. Yeah, and it's a, it's a bit ironic, actually, because the story of that last match was the tech chase on reaction by over Triforce. And the first time I really saw any Sheik do that, it was actually against Leffen. It was Drug Fox at EVO, ah, I believe, yeah. 2013 or 14. And uh, that was the first time I ever saw any Sheik do that and just take whole stocks with the tech chasing. Right, right, right. 
Uh, Leffen seems to be a popular recipient. Yeah. But taking the first stock this uh, in this game four. Yeah. Definitely looking to even up the and, and, and there it is. Uh, more of what I'm used to seeing from Leffen against Sheiks, baiting out these options like dash attacks and aerials and, and punishing just being barely out of reach. Yeah, Leffen looking to prove a point here, but mm -hmm. it's a bit too uh, overzealous and uh, over is able to find a down air on the way down. Wow. Wow, and it KOs. Yeah. Which Not is surprising to me as an American yeah, because I'm used to it never KOing. <laughs> yeah. when, I, when I think it will. Yeah, yeah. I saw your set versus Aski Flink, and you had a very high percent uh, up smash. Yeah, I, I up smash him, and like he, you know, he'd be a 140. I'd be like, okay, you yeah. know, I guess that's just, <laughs> I guess that's just pal. Yeah, that's just life in Sweden. <laughs> 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 All right, but yeah, uh, you know, unless unless something goes very different, differently here, we're we're looking at a game five. Ooh, ah, really he, tricky recovery there by uh, Over. Mm -hmm. She's getting better at the mix-up. Yeah, he does the. Um, Ooh. Nice. Yeah, Even with the charge. squeezing in the charge there, yeah. I think he needed to, right? Yeah. yeah. There's no way that would have uh, just uh, killed if it was uncharged. And it shows good composure, like, even when you're down in the set, to uh, be able to identify, like, hey, I have time to charge right, my moves right. a little bit here. It's not too antsy to just uh, get out the next move and hope for the best. Really good down tilt. Oh, and oh, there, there finally is, yeah. finds the shine spike. Mm -hmm. Three stock victory here. One thing I do notice about Over is he does uh, he does have that tendency to sort of drift just kind of towards the stage, mm. and he sets himself up to get shine spiked sometimes. Whereas, uh, you know, he could have, for example, once you see the fox kind of threatening to go out there, you know, you kind of want to lean back sometimes. Yeah. I feel like I feel like he could have made that shine spike a little harder for left again. But you know, we're on game five on Pokemon uh, sorry. Found a dreams. And this is exactly what Over wants, right? This is a great stage for this matchup and he's that was, poised to make a huge upset here. Yeah, and that was a really good start for him too. If that needle had connected, Leffen would be in a world of trouble. Mm. Was that the DI that that could he have gotten a four four tilt off that or, or no? I would like to say yes, because usually in my experience, if they DI that way, you get the forward tilt. But mm -hmm. uh, that jump from Leffen looked uh, too early in uh -huh. order for uh, the forward tilt to connect. So maybe it's uh, uh, just uh, slightly too high percent for that to, to work. Yeah. Wow. Leffen clearly has played more PAL uh, than I have, because he's getting the up smash KOs when they matter this yeah. game. Lots of wave shine up smashes from Leffen. Over up being on the stage, probably an accident, and Leffen just playing a little faster than he did, you know, for, for uh, compared to most of the set. Yeah, moving faster. There's a again, just winning ground game by by virtue of attrition. <laughs> oh, that oh. drop back here just KOs. Yeah, and that was a tech chase opportunity for Over. So that's a bit of a two stock swing, but equalizes it here. Yeah, Leffen trying to find the up tilt. Let's uh, Over roll in from the ledge. Mm -hmm. Okay, over with the grab now. Ah, it wasn't ready. Le Levin, for the first time in the set, not doing the full uh, away DI on the down throw. Right. Nice the stuff from attacked. over. Yep. Oh. Could have gotten another one there. Yeah, I think if he had reacted to the fact that his back air did not, uh, did not hit hard. Yep. Could have just down smashed. In fact. Yeah, because he went for the, the full hop, which mm -hmm. is the right option if the fox is far away from the stage because then you can needle further out. But uh, yeah. yeah, with a little nick like that, you want to be uh, short hopping just so you can react to the um, ledge ish options. But yep. over, oh, and giving over. away a stock there. So, uh, winner's bracket stock for over Tripors here and has to make a, a stock comeback here if he uh, wants to make this happen. This is how you're going to start it with the tech chase. Oh. Yeah, Levin taking in place two times in a row. Yeah. Left and not the kind of guy to just run into a down smash either. Ooh, and there we go with that early up B to avoid the shine spike. Oh, and he... Oh! Oh, oh no! Oh. And over Triforce not double jumping in time. No, uh, that was unfortunate. Up being in time. What a good showing from over Triforce, though. Yeah, he really almost put it all together. And Leffen shrugging his shoulders. Doesn't seem all that impressed. But uh, Over definitely has to be happy with yeah. his performance. Like, he's, he's uh, got a winning mentality, so I'm sure he feels disappointed right now. But taking Leffen...